so worried. We're not gonna die. I promise you that. Next is PW-01408. That's you. We will now begin the Age Aptitude Test. Please try to relax. Stage 1. Inducing Ashblight Corruption. <laughs> Ashblight Corruption has been confirmed. Now progressing to Stage 2. Mounting God Arc. is complete. You are now an adaptive god-eater. So you survived. Grade A. Oh, we haven't seen your kind around here before. How does it feel to give up your humanity? <laughs> hey, don't go and croak on us, okay? Your life belongs to the port now. You're of no use, dead. Here, I'm gonna need you to sign this contract. Come on, let's go.
Hey, you okay? You seem pretty out of it. Bad dream or something? Anyway, rise and shine. I went ahead and asked about our next job. It's in a pretty thick spot. Looks like there's not too much time left for you and me, huh? Fighting in ash this thick will ruin a body in no time. And if we can't work? Well, I doubt the folks at the port will want to look after us. Eventually, we're either going to run out of the bias factor we need to live, or we'll end up as origami snacks or bait, and that'll be that. A time-honored end for ages like you and me. Yeah, well, that's not gonna happen to us. I promise. After all, we've got too much riding on our shoulders. We'll keep going for the ones we couldn't save. It's a vow I made to them all. I'm never going to give up, no matter what happens. So, that's that. We are not dying. The two of us will keep moving forward onto whatever tomorrow brings.
I can't see! Where is it? Where's the origami? Our lines are crossed. What team are you with? Requesting salvage! Please! I don't want to die! Forget them. They're already origami, Chow. You've got your own jobs to do, so get to them. Hurry up and let us loose. I am now releasing the restraints on Pennyward Ages Hound 1 and Hound 2. Alright, you dogs. Sick them. I'm limiting your operation area. If you try to do any moonlighting, well, you know what happens. Yeah, we know. Shall we? We'll make it out of this. Follow the program you were given and acclimate to the Ashlands. Once you've acclimated, return immediately. The Fetters will be written off. That is all. Something unexpected might happen. If it does, I'll use my own judgment. Unnecessary combat may result in the loss of God Arcs. Thus, fighting is prohibited. Proceed with tests to confirm effectiveness in high ash density conditions. Yeah, yeah. How are you doing? I think I'm alright. Are you disoriented? Look straight ahead for me. Well, you should be fine then. Let's move. Follow me. in that area. Move back. Another team is operating there. Yeah, sure. The ones with their wires crossed? Keep a safe distance. Let's play it safe for now. It's funny how no matter how hairy it gets, I always have fun when you're around. If you find high ground, climb on up. It's always an advantage in a fight. Looking down on origami crawling beneath you feels pretty good too. This is Hound 1. I'm at Point Alpha. Can you break through their line? Understood. I'll get through somehow. You do not have permission to transmit. You want to get written up? Hey, you can't blame me for being curious. Idiot. Still got some stamina? It's easy to get winded this deep in the Ashlands. Clear out the origami in the area. Proceed with caution. You go. I owe you for this. You do not have permission to transmit. Don't make me tell you again. You haven't completed the acclimation program. Proceed with your assigned mission. If we can fight this deep in the Ashlands, who gives a crap about acclimation? You'll be disciplined for insubordination. I hope you're ready for that. Sure, whatever you say. Now quit looking over my shoulder. Saying we're fighting in dense ash is enough of an excuse, right? You'll regret this. fight in gun form, too. See if you can transform for me. More company. 
Let's go. I'll try this! Attacks expend OP. You can fight in blade form to restore your supply. Don't give up so easily. Nobody's got time to wipe your nose for you here. Okay, time to head home and get in our cells. Don't worry, everyone made it back okay. A good result for us. We might do as the port folks want. Work ourselves to the bone get dragged to hell and back. But that doesn't mean we're willing to give up our lives without a good fight. A place where ages can live out their lives without being controlled or pushed around by anyone. That's what we need, right? Took the words right out of my mouth. <laughs> Ouch! <laughs> the guards went to town on you this time, didn't they? Bet that hurts. You never do as you're told, huh? Bet it's hell getting teamed up with this guy. <laughs> I didn't know you were back from patrol, Zeke. Yep, that's right. All done with my work for today. Listen, man, next time you should come out with me. Come on. I thought you were smarter than that. Having a chance to work with THE Zeke Pennyworth should be enough to make you weep for joy. <laughs> Maybe you should mention how good you are. <laughs> Hugo's always so by the book, it must have been boring out there with him. Come on, I'll show you a real cool trick next time. This isn't a sport, Zeke. Look, I know that. You think I don't know that? Anyway, did you hear the recent news? One of the other teams was saying that a port nearby got swallowed by the ash. That's the first I've heard of it. But it's not exactly news for ports to get engulfed by the Ashlands. Sure, it's no surprise when it's some base somewhere. But how will you feel when the ash is creeping closer and closer? Are you talking about an ash storm? Yeah, well... If one of those ash storms does come through, it's not like there's a whole lot we can do other than strap in and pray, right? Yeah, that's about the size of it. Though, even then, riding one out isn't all that realistic. 